We're good, he says. Okay. Do you want me to do all three? Breathe it aloud. All three? Okay. <clears throat> Someone, he agrees. Someone was taking self from me. Every time self was taken away, I just made a new batch of self. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It had a bunch of stuff in it. <laughs> That's the first one. Do you want me to go on to the second one now? No? Do it once more. Okay. Someone was trying, oh, someone was taking self from me. Every time self was taken away, I just made a new batch of self. Good. Right. What was it like in the dream? Um, it was... Uh, first, first... Right, right, right. Go ahead. Read the it. The first part was... Um, someone? Go ahead. Right. The first one, the first part was uh, like curious to me um, because because um, of their the reasoning of how they thought they could take self from me. Mm -hmm. It didn't seem like they could actually do that. Could you describe what it was like when someone was taking? The yeah, self it was. From um, okay. Oh God, how would I explain it? Um, I'm trying to go back into the dream. Because this happened, what was it? Like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, something like that. Um, in the dream. Yeah, I'm trying to go back to the dream. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, I see why you're having a problem. Okay. Um, it was a, curious to me. It was illogical to me. It was... Um, why are they doing that? Um, like, what makes them feel like they have the power to do that? Say it again. What makes them feel like they have the power to do that? That's an interesting question. Like, what makes them think they have the power? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Pierre, can we make it so she can see the board as well? Yeah. I don't know how we can do it, but somehow. Maybe like this a little way or something like that. Yeah. See some yeah, of it? that's good. Good. Second part now? No. Okay, still in the first? Okay. Read it again. I'm going to ask you about one word. Okay. Someone was taking... That's enough. Okay. Right. What are they doing? They're taking. Hmm. Right. Right. From you. Right. Which what doesn't make taking? sense. Self. Hmm. Right. Taking means what? Something... They were trying to take it away. And it's going on? Is it... Uh, they're Someone trying is... to make it go on. They are trying to make it go on. Right. Uh, were they successful in the first sentence? Um, no, I don't think they were. That if someone was trying to. Right, right. Is that right? Yeah. That's a right. big difference. Okay. It's in the dream? Yes, I believe it is, yes. Yeah, okay. All right, try the next one. Every time self was taken away, Hold it. right, I Same say it question. again. Right. What it, does that look like? It was like they were, um, like trying to say that or prove that or show me that there was no self. Hmm. Right, that's different, isn't it? Yeah. See the difference? Yeah. Okay. Right. How would you then say it? It's not that they're doing it again. Right. But rather. They're tr they're they're 
trying to prove that they can do it. Right, right. There's a they, you say, not he or she. Right. Well, because I don't, the person in my dream is not clear to me. Okay, okay. So they were trying to do it right. again and again and again. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Next one. Um, I just made a new batch of self. Yeah, okay, so. <laughs> Huh? You made a whole bunch of new selves. Yeah. Now, what was that like, making new selves in the dream? Um, that was a curious state because um, it was like I was making a cake. <laughs> but <laughs> I was making self. That's all right. Come on, making a cake. Go yeah, ahead. like, okay, I can, I can put a little bit of this in there. I can put a little bit of that in there. I can put these elements in it. And, uh, and you just stir it up in their self. What was it like doing it? It was, it felt powerful. More? Um, it felt like, yeah, like I was disproving them. Disprove, I was disproving them. Like, see, I can just do this, and I can do this, and I can just make himself again. So you can't ever take it away from me. What was that like? You can never take it away from me. That also felt very powerful. Powerful? Well, yeah. Use um, other words. Come on, powerful. Um, knowledge, knowledgeful. What? It's had knowledge in it. Knowledge? Yeah. Um, it had wisdom in it. Um, it had... Um, Uh, like I knew the steps on how to get there. Um, Say it again. I knew the steps on how to get there. I need. I knew the steps. I knew the steps. Yeah. You're familiar with this process, yes. right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right. Like any time I needed it, I could just whip it up again. Yeah. If that makes any sense. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've got a small question for you. <clears throat> what is it that's doing it? Me. Me. What are you pointing your shirt for? <laughs> this person. What? This a person I identify with? Mm. <laughs> right. Yeah, I don't know what to say about that. Yeah, see. I knew the steps. Yeah. I knew, I knew how to do all this. Yeah. Right. By the way, if someone could do that, what would you call them? Uh, Car I, carpenter. No. Oh, okay, let me try again. Barkeeper. No. Um, uh, is there anyone else? Parmenides type of person? I don't know. No, no, try it. Um, what do you think of someone who could do what you're doing in the dream? What would you call the way you are functioning? Like a, a person that knows uh, the steps on how to achieve self. Right, right. All right, say it again. Like Parmenides, right? Yeah, it's just someone who... It's like a Parmenides type of person. Oh, that knows the self. Right, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Again, what was that like to say? Oh, I knew the steps, of it had certain knowledge involved, it was very powerful being able to do that. Right. Yeah. What was it, well, you want me to explain what it's, what it's like again? Um, uh, in the dream, it was natural. That's, that's true. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Um, <coughs> I didn't really have to think about it. It just like flowed out of me. Yeah. Yeah. So what in your mind, in your thinking, your reading, 
Uh, what would be able to do this? The self. Oh. So you you have a self that can make other selves. What kind of thing does that? I am don't know. I would like to know more. Um, yeah, what kind of self does that? That's an interesting question. Yeah, I like it myself. I need to ponder that a little bit more. Um, I need to think about it. No. Don't. <laughs> I don't need to think about it? No. Oh, God, I don't know. Um, nothing's coming to me right now. The person would definitely have knowledge, they would have insight, they would have... Um, knowledge of like ping pong? No, a higher knowledge. Um, knowledge of ultimate reality? Yeah, yeah. Then how are you functioning? <coughs> On a very high scale. I don't know. Yes, you do. <laughs> um, oh God, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Now we'll do the next dream. Yeah, this one I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one. Go ahead. I go from that to this. Okay. I was at this gathering of people. It was like a fair, but also like an outdoor mall. I met a bunch of people, but something about it felt foreign, alien-like. I didn't want to be there. I felt very uncomfortable being there. I was introduced to a man. It was like a hookup type of introduction, and I just wanted to get away. So I said I had to go to the bathroom, and so I went to the bathroom. This bathroom I have seen before in my dreams, seen in my dreams before. It was gross and disgusting. Very small stalls, tight and confining. They didn't look like they were, had been cleaned in years. So I, I leave the bathroom and aimlessly wander around with no direction, focus, or purpose. I then see an old friend that I don't want to recognize me or see me, as I don't want to talk to her. Everything is going well. She doesn't seem to see me but her daughter does and says, hey, isn't that Belinda? And my old friend says yes, but continues to keep walking. I can hear them talking about me, but I don't quite hear what they're saying. Hmm. Could you pick up the sentence, so I leave the bathroom? Uh, okay. And do, 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 do. Okay, and aimlessly wander around with no direction. Uh huh. Uh, focus or purpose. Go ahead. Um. I then see an old friend that I don't. Hold it. Okay. What's that like? Yeah, I didn't like being in that state. Mm -hmm. I didn't like being there. Didn't like being there. Mm -mm. I don't know. No, I don't like not having a focus or a purpose or yeah. just aimlessly wandering around with nothing yeah. Yeah. I'm doing <clears throat> that's important. Mm -hmm. um, what's it like when the girl, her daughter, it says, hey, isn't that Belinda? Yeah. My old friend? Yeah. Um, yeah, her daughter sees me right. and says, hey, isn't that Belinda? And my old friend, the one that I didn't want to see me, uh, says yes, but continues to keep walking. What's it like when she saw you? I didn't want her. I was not happy about it. Right. No, no. It all comes, it seems, uh, 
what all comes out of that one encounter with that man in the third line. Is that right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, talk yeah it's the it. same type of situation. Yeah, same type of situation? Yeah. Again and again. Yeah. Yeah. Talk to me in the dream at that moment. Yeah, I it's like I did I not was introduced right, to a man. Yeah, Go yeah. Ahead. I didn't like being there. I didn't want to be there. I didn't want this interaction to be going on. I did not want to talk to him. Um, I just wanted to get as far away as I could. Right. Right. That had a, quite an effect on you in yeah. the dream. Yeah, it, it, but right. I just wanted to leave. Right, so this state continues. Right? Yes. Yeah, well, it continues throughout the whole dream. I just yeah. wanted to leave, yeah. just wanted well, to leave, just wanted to leave. Describe the guy. He was a normal guy. He, he wasn't, uh, I don't know what I didn't like about him. I just. It's okay, the normal guy, more. Yeah. Yeah, just the I don't know what I didn't like about him. Yeah, I didn't know what I didn't like about him. Right, right. but... Huh. I just didn't want to do that kind of interaction. Yeah. I didn't know what I disliked about him. Right. But one thing, you know, you didn't like the interaction. Yeah, I didn't want to interact with him in that right. manner. There's a certain kind of interaction. Yeah. Call it, describe it. Um, a relationship type, or f maybe a possible future relation type relationship. What kind? Uh, Gambling? No, Hope. possible Hope. like Hope. boyfriend girlfriend relationship, possibly, I don't know. So this kind of was joking, but it's an invitation to a relationship. Yeah, yes, right? yes. No, no, no. And he's a normal guy. You don't know why he yeah. disliked him. Yeah. But, he didn't even he, say anything to me. He didn't even say anything. No. But he didn't like that in kind of encounter yeah. that was an invitation to a yeah. relationship. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. And that carried out through the rest of the dream. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> um, I'm not sure I know what you mean by uh, in, the, in the dream. Right. At that moment when you looked and you said, I don't like that kind of relationship. Right. right. You put it in a very nice way. Right. Uh, Hookup type of introduction. <laughs> yeah. No, what is, is that fishing? Hooking, oh, hooking up? yeah, yeah, like they're trying to hook us together. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, talk about that, come on. Uh, yeah, I just, I, I don't want to be there. I don't want to be in that type of relationship. Right. That starts out as a, come on. A hookup type of relationship. As a hookup type of introduction. Yes, yes, exactly. Yeah. yeah that's like right. if it was another type of introduction, like if they wanted us to be friends, no. I'd be all totally okay with that. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but this is evidently more intimate. Yes. Right, okay. And you're saying? No. No. Right? Yeah. But it has an effect on you. Yes, it does. Right. It puzzles you. Yeah. Yeah, I don't understand what it is I don't like about him. Yeah. Yeah. But on reflection, you're saying, this is what I don't like. Yeah. That kind of a invitation for a hookup. Right. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Um, uh, you've been in this situation in the past? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And now it's coming back? Yeah. In the dream? Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah. Anything go on two seven? Yeah. Day before? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> what are you saying? Um This is a real life event that took place. 
Pretty close. I've been dreaming about it. Pretty close to it, yes. No. Pretty, pretty close. Hmm. Then, so here's the question. What is the dream telling you that you didn't know at the time? What I don't like about the guy. And it looks like it's this. Yes. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. Hmm. What difference does that make, knowing that? It makes me uh, more secure about my intuition and what I'm doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. This gives you more reassurance. That you know yeah, what, and I'm you know doing the right doing thing. And right. what you're rejecting. Right. Ah, it's similar to this. Is it really? Yes. Say it again. Say it again. I forgot what you just said. Is it really? Yeah, I did. Go ahead. <laughs> I did really. Yeah, I forgot. What was it you just saying? Is it really, like the like the first one? I don't know. Just say what you just said a moment ago. I don't remember what I said. <laughs> <laughs> this state of mind, come on. Is like the first? Yeah, that's what we were saying. But we said something before about it. I I I it was. It, the question is, what did this dream bring you that you hadn't thought of? the preceding day. Huh. It, this is making something clear. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I got it now. You got it? Yeah. Right. Yeah. What, what's that state of mind like? Um, the taking or, uh, no, the, 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 the view that I feel like the person is trying to take self away from me, but they're not actually doing it. Yeah. They're knowing. Yeah. It's powerful. Yeah. It's natural. Yeah. Right? Yeah. You're in that state of mind now. Yeah. Two dreams yes, I am. Right? Yeah. By heavens, is it possible you have a third? Yeah, I do. Okay, I was lurking around this old place I used to live at. I was looking around trying to see what had changed about it. I then realize that the people who live there will see me lurking about. And the woman we had in the past bought the house from would see us also, or would see me, sorry, would see me, not us. Um, for she lived next door to this place. Then I'm in my parents' bedroom. The back of their bedroom is open to a waterfall. I notice a baby playing in a pool of water. It looks like the baby is struggling not to drown. So I go over to the baby to help, in, help it to continue to play in the water without drowning. How are you doing? I'm doing good. Well, in the first part, no. In the second part, yes. Yes. Right. Give me the transition. Uh, where I leave the... Uh, I leave that one state of mind and I go into this other state of mind or, or a different place. I go from one place to a different place. The baby is in what state of mind? Come on. Oh, it's, it's happy, it's, it's gurgling, it's just, oh my God, it's like just so happy to be playing in this water. It, it was but, the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Thank you. But what follows? Um, it, it looks like it's struggling to not drown, though. That's, and I start to get concerned for the baby. Mm -hmm. So I go over so it can still continue to play in the water and enjoy itself. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. but make sure it doesn't drown. Yeah. What was that like? Um, it was, um, I was happy. I was happy in that state. Yeah. And it was also one of the most beautiful things that you have ever seen? Mm-hmm. Yeah, along with the waterfall, yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. A dull? No. No, not what? Uh, it was very interesting. Oh, but not powerful. Oh, no, it was powerful. Oh, it was powerful. Yes, it oh. was. Do you know what you were doing? Uh, I, yeah, I'd like to know more about it, though. 
Yeah, it was natural. Yeah. All three dreams. You're entering into. Yeah. Interesting. Only we can add something to it. Beauty. Nice. Rather interesting, isn't it? Yeah. No. Oh. No. Oh. How you doing? Good. No. Yeah. Thank you. Think something of it. <laughs> okay, cool. Thank you. Anybody see Eldar? Yeah. Where? Oh, there he is. Come on, way up there. I was riding the bus. I was looking out the window, looking at things going by. I looked outside and a Mercedes swooshed by in the last moment before the bus would have cut him off. I was wondering about the bus driver. Is he a little reckless or was he just being assertive? The bus was going up a street that I recognized. The bus makes a very interesting turn, a very broad turn getting very close to a building and taking up a lot of space. I didn't know if the bus could make the turn. That's how far wide uh, he went. He started to go into a U-turn. I recognized another structure outside. It was like a statue, a monument. I'm in Germany. This is Germany. And the bus started to move in an interesting way. I asked myself, how is this bus moving in this way? This must be a special bus, a special German bus. Uh, I think the back wheels must be able to turn as well. Uh, we were reversing in a spiraling kind of way, which wouldn't be possible if the back wheels weren't able to turn. I saw another familiar building, which was a public restroom. And I decided, I want to get off here. I want to explore this. And I pulled on the stop signal as I saw a familiar tunnel leading up some place where I used to go. The bus finished its very special turn. I looked around me and I realized, I thought, hey, this is, this is like a dream. Am I dreaming? I asked myself, where was I before? But then I thought, no, I don't want to ask myself where I was before because that might take me back there. And then I said, yeah, I'm dreaming. I was looking at the bus seats in front of me and realizing, yes, I'm dreaming, being happy about it, and at the same time, I didn't want it to go away. I asked myself, uh, what do I want to do? I want to use this opportunity. I want to do something of my own will. As my awareness that I was dreaming grew, I realized that it was starting to fade, like I was trying, starting to be pulled out of the dream. The seats in front of me were normal. Uh, I focused on them, but everything apart from them was kind of a fuzzy gray. I wanted to turn towards the unknown fuzzy gray area and start singing to break out and do something while I'm uh, lucid, in my lucid dream. I was a little worried about what would be over there in that grey, fuzzy, unknown space, but I wanted to turn and break free into it. I was very tempted to have a look. It was incredible to know that I was dreaming. I was like, yeah, yeah, this is it, this is it, hold on to it. Uh, it became harder to hold on to my dream and I saw myself waking up or slipping away out of it. I closed my eyes and kind of relaxed into it. I tried to open them again and it was really hard. It felt good to have them closed. It felt very expansive, wide and broad to have them closed. Now, what do you make of the dream? 
Um, it was really mm -hmm. a, a wonderful dream. Yeah, yeah. What yeah. else? Go ahead. Um, it seemed like I was, uh, I was recognizing. I was recognizing a lot of things mm -hmm. um, leading up to the mm -hmm. uh, lucid part. Um, yeah, like it's almost like the more I kept recognizing, the more aware I was, or something like that. No. <clears throat> So, you notice you're going to the second part of the dream rather than the first? <clears throat> yep. Find that anything curious about that? Um, I was, I was focusing on, I was focusing on the exciting part. Oh, more. Um, I, um, it, it was just a really um, an amazing experience that I... What was amazing about that experience in the first part of the dream? Oh, in the first part? Yes, all my... Which, which paragraph? It's broken in half. Okay. <coughs> I looked around and I realized, I thought, everything that came before that is three paragraphs. What do you make of the first three paragraphs? Is there a puzzle there? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. In the dream, is there a puzzle there in the first three paragraphs? I'm not sure. It's um, What are you wondering about? Like, where am I? No. How is this bus moving in this way? Read the first two lines. Um, I was riding the bus. I was looking out the window, looking at things going by. Go ahead. I looked outside and a Mercedes swooshed by in the last moment before the bus would have cut him off. Hmm. I was wondering about the bus driver. Thank you. What are you wondering about? The bus driver. Thank you. I'm wondering about the bus driver. Go ahead. Yeah. Um, I never actually saw him, but I was wondering um, the way that he was driving. Oh, more than once? And the dream? Yeah, I think twice. Twice? Or maybe three times. Or maybe four. Yeah. Uh, take a look. Come on. Yeah, there was... Um, the first, the Mercedes, but yeah. then I think there was also a second car yeah, okay. again, and then also the the turn, yeah, getting very close to the building. Yeah, second, go ahead. Yeah, keep going. Um, well, then there was also the very special turning, which yeah, three. didn't seem to make sense. That's right. Go ahead. Four. Yeah, but I, those ones I attribute more to the, you know, it's a special bus. I don't know. I guess. No, I guess the driver can be blamed. It's got to be a German bus. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> something about that that word German. It's like yeah. something special. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> right. Five. Go ahead. More. Um, yeah, I mean, I think that's it. 
It was reversing in a spiraling kind of way. Six. Go ahead, Lauren. Yeah, it was very strange. Yeah, go ahead. Well, and then... Um, then reversing in a spiral? Yeah. Seven? <clears throat> well, then it, when I, you know, when I pulled the stop thing... Eight? It didn't stop. Right. <clears throat> and then a bunch of it disappeared. Right. How many puzzles have leached in there? Twenty. <laughs> yeah, lots. <laughs> right? Look here, see? You got a whole bunch of very interesting puzzles, mm -hmm. right? And then there's a break. And now you're talking about the fact that you're now aware that you are dreaming. Mm -hmm. And what is your question in the dream? Well, I was wondering where I was before yeah. this. Yeah. When it was like a, um, I wanted to check whether or not I was lucid dreaming. Yeah. So I asked myself, uh, wait a second, <coughs> was I in the bus before or is this a dream? Mm -hmm. it's, it's a uh, which, which state of mind are you in, in the waking, waking uh, episode in the dream? The lucid dreaming time. What state of mind are you in? Very, um, very alert. More. Uh, very. Very clear in a in a fresh kind of way. Like More. like. Um, feels really like new and kind of like almost young or something. Um, Not powerful or anything like that. Oh, it's dull. Very powerful. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's yeah. like, it's kind of, um, it has kind of like a, a heat to it, like a, like a buzz. Oh. Uh, 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 like a, uh, like a, hot energy. Yeah, yeah, good, 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 good. And it's like, yeah. uh, I want to say wet. Okay. Like, it's kind of like, yeah. 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 Um, <clears throat> you find it interesting that you're not using the language in the dream? This language? No. Yeah. Uh, like to describe the what's happening? Yeah, would you do the uh, fifth paragraph, first sentence, first two sentences? Yeah, go ahead. I was looking at the bus seats in front of me and realizing, yes, I'm dreaming, being happy about it. Thank you. I was very happy about it. Yeah. How happy? A little bit? I was like, come on, ecstatic. Ecstatic, that's different than just happy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What does that mean? Very excited and like like a, a kid that just got a, a toy that he always wanted on his like fifth birthday. Yeah, perfect. Right? Yeah. Like a toy you yeah, always it was wanted as a kid. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it was that, like, that, see, that's defining a kind of uh, happiness, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. By the way, have you been happy before in your life? Yeah, I have. Uh, where would you put this experience? The highest. That pair. Yeah. It was very amazing. Mm. Oh, by the way, what happened to all the questions you had? About the driver and about uh, the bus? Uh, 
that would have been a good time to answer yeah. them. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that's really good. What do you find about it? That's great. That's mm. that's great. Because I, I had this kind of state. Yeah. Uh, the day before. Good. What happened? Uh, I was talking to this girl. Right. And. I'm good at drawing girls. A and um, I was really uh, focused on on listening. Uh, I was really focused on like just taking her in everything she was talking about, and then suddenly like I went into that state, mm -hmm. and uh, that I was just thinking that would have been a great thing for me to ask her all these questions that I had. Yes. Before, because I was kind of, when I was in it, I was like, "Whoa, okay, I'm here. Yeah. Now, what do I, um, <laughs> like, what do I do with it?" Yeah. And then it was there for like, I don't know, maybe. What would you have liked to have asked her? Mm. Or explored. Lots of things. I'm just interested in her, uh, like. At that time, though. At that time. Yeah, like you're interested in her, and, and you're focused, and you're listening to what she's saying. Uh, does that have an effect on her? That she's seeing you're listening and focusing on her? Yeah. What did it do to her? Mm. She was bored. No, she became like very, um, very animated and colorful and. Um, just like bubbly and really yeah, yeah, yeah. great state of mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what did you do next? Um, I, it was like when I was in it, first I was kind of surprised that I was in it. Mm -hmm. Then I, I played with it a little bit like... Um, just like in the dream. Yeah, like I, I, it was like, I just like dipped my toes into the water, kind of, mm -hmm. and then, yeah. That was pulled out of the mystery. Pulled out of the mystery. To go any further would have involved you in... Probably a really interesting, maybe profound conversation. Yeah, yeah. Good thing you didn't because, you know, they're not worth it. Are they? Obviously not. <laughs> <laughs> what is your dream telling you? Um, it's kind of answering the question I had. Yeah. Ever since that happened. So you got involved in your own state of mind in your own state of mind, and you didn't use it to go back to discover the mystery. You enjoyed the state you were into. Mm -hmm. She enjoyed it. To go any further, finish it. Um, I think I would need to... Uh, like use the state mm. to uh, it's kind of like to do something with it like yeah. um yeah um but you backed away from it yeah i i feel like i should well, but you enjoyed the state you're in right yeah. so that's that's kind of a puzzle to me like yeah. how how do i um same thing over here um yeah, finish it. My, my puzzle is like, um, how can I... Uh, it's like I'm distracted by the enjoyment of the yes, state. Yes, got it. But how can I just like not be distracted by the enjoyment because I'm enjoying it? Like, I feel like it's automatic. So put it aside and continue with your interest. <laughs> Forget yourself. Forget yourself. Yeah. That's a that's good advice. Yeah, what would that do to the relationship? 
Um, yeah, forget <laughs> myself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. Sure. Thank you. Do you want that shit, Melinda? Pleasure. Yeah, that was wonderful. Thank you. Should I start? I was at school in my history class, and there were a Pakistani and uh, an Iraqi person. Louder. Yeah, a little slower. Slower okay. and louder. Yeah. yeah. I was at school in my history class. And there, was a, there were a Pakistani and an Iraqi person. I don't remember what they were doing, but their intentions seemed to be good. They wanted the class to learn. After history, I go to my Spanish class, where the, teachers, the teacher pairs me up with Cade. We're closer physically than mentally, but we still talk to each other quite a bit, mostly about the homework the teacher has assigned us. We work on a worksheet, and now the worksheet is the dream, mm -hmm. where, where I am filling it with the help of my Hold brother. It. Hold it. Could you do it again, please? Do it over. Yeah. We work on a worksheet. I was at school. The whole thing? I was at school in my history class, and there were a Pakistani and an Iraqi person. It was what? Uh, like a person from Pakistan and one okay. from Iraq. Okay, okay. And I don't remember what they were doing, but their intentions seemed to be good. They seemed to be good people. Um, they wanted the class to learn. They what? Wanted the class to learn. Oh, to learn. Yeah. Um, after history, I go to my Spanish class where the teacher pairs me up with Cade. She what? With Cade. Cade is one of my classmates. Oh, oh. she looks up with Cade? She gets paired up. Yeah. Paired up. Okay. Okay. Oh. We are closer physically than mentally, but we still talk to each other quite a bit, uh, mostly about the homework the teacher has assigned us. We work on a worksheet and now the worksheet is the dream. The dream. The dream. Yeah. Sorry. It's hard. Okay, now the worksheet is the dream. Thank you. <laughs> Where I am filling it with the help of my brother at home, like it was homework, or at school with Cade, and a ton of, a ton of random thoughts pass before I find myself back at school with Kate, and we're correcting our worksheet, which I kept this whole time. Yeah. The setting shifts, and now I'm at my aunt's farm. It's like a farmhouse or a country house. The setting is more rural, and after I say hi to everyone, oh. we're on the back, yeah. Tell me which page goes in. Is that the first page? This is the back of that one? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Um, the setting is more rural, and after I say hi to everyone, we're sitting in the, in the living room, and they're asking me things because they haven't seen me in a while. We end up talking about the fact that, yes, I do do homework and work at home, like when I had to take the English test to test my English, and when I do my history and Spanish homework. See, I was kind of like trying to show to them that I do my homework, I guess. I don't know. 
uh, I go to the room in front of the kitchen where there's a table. There are two men I don't really know nor trust. I think, I think before I'm left here alone with them, my aunt and dad are talking about money. And now my aunt is about to make an investment in something and it will pay back after some years. I remember thinking to myself that that was a bad idea. The men, the two men in the kitchen, in the room outside of the kitchen, are again from Pakistan and Iran or Iraq, I, I don't know. Um, we start talking and they seem suspicious. They are dressed weird and handling guns and filling up bullets. We're talking and I tell the, the guy from Pakistan something like, you know, there are Pakistani men at school too. And he asked me something like, how do you know? Or how do you recognize us? And I say, I can see it from your eyes. And he says, how? Well, they're that blue. And here it starts to get more uncomfortable because it's, he says, are they this blue? And he says it with crazy eyes, mm. kind of. And, uh, and, and he says, can their pupils do this? And he starts to do something weird with his pupils, making them bigger and smaller. <laughs> I see that the bullets they were filling up uh, with eye drops and not uh, bullet gunpowder. Just eye drops, I don't know. And, um, and I think to myself that maybe these men are more crazy than dangerous. The Iranian guy jumps in and says something to the other guy, like, cut the crap, because he was like kind of trying to scare me. And the other guy jumps in and he says, stop it. Um, or anyway, makes him stop. And so I go out to play. You have to <laughs> Outside the farmhouse. We were inside the house. Oh, OK. Oh, yeah. OK. Um. What do you make of it? Hmm? What do you make of it so far? Um, I think this is kind of like setting the scene. Well, was that the whole thing? Or? No, 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 it goes oh, on. There's more. Yeah. I don't think he knows. Yeah, no, he does realize that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> um, well, I see a big difference between the first part and the second part. The first part, I'm here. And the second part, I'm in Italy, mm -hmm. where I'm from. And it's two completely different settings, and there are two men in both parts that are supposed to be the same, but are very different. So what do you make of the homework you're doing? I don't know. And the drink? Um, what do I make of it? Yeah, well, just tell me what's it like in the dream during the homework assignments that you're doing. That's it's all. like every day. That's everyday stuff. Yeah. No, no, no. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Well, there are some parts of it that are not like every day. <coughs> so the whole dream depends upon this couple of lines on page one. You think so? Like <coughs> when the homework becomes the dream? Yeah. The teacher has assigned us some work. We work on a... Worksheet. Yeah. And what's the, what are you doing? The worksheet is what? It's like a piece of paper, I think. And then it turns into something more? Nope. Read it. We work on a worksheet, and now the worksheet is the dream, where I'm filling it with the help of my brother. What are you doing in the dream at that moment? Filling the worksheet. Doing what? Filling in the worksheet. With what? What's the subject? I am? I don't know, I just asked. Yeah, I am doing the homework. 
What kind of homework? <coughs> uh, I don't know. Yes, you do. Read think, it. Think. We work on a, go ahead. Worksheet. Yeah, to read it, go ahead. <clears throat> Oh, it's a dream. Yeah! <laughs> what are you doing, homework? What are you laughing for? Because <laughs> I'm like working on the dream. Yeah, you're working on a dream. Yeah. Homework. Yeah. <laughs> you think it's just everyday stuff? Not really. It's not really? No. Oh, you're doing what? <coughs> you're doing dream work as an assignment. And your brother helps you. Somehow, yeah. So in the dream, come on, yes yeah. or no? Yes, he does. Right, so he's helping? Yeah. And you're reflecting on it? Yeah. Right? What's it like in the dream? It's like, I feel like I have this duty that I have to do that. Of course. What's it like having to do that? I'm okay with it. What? I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I want to do it. I don't know what that means. What's that like? I want to do it. It's like I'm happy to do it. It's like I want to and I have to. Yes. But what's that like? Because often you can separate them. Some things I have to do I may not like. But a lot of things that I want to do, I want to do. Right, but you have them both. Mm -hmm. Right? What's that like in the dream? It, it's good. I don't know the I... word good. Come on, put some other words on it. I'll help you. It was tiring, boring. I was no. disgusted with it. My brother was a jerk. It was interesting. It was oh, exciting. Oh, interesting. Go ahead, more. <laughs> it was exciting. Exciting. More. It was uh, entertaining, I guess, in a way. Entertaining. You're, what kind of thinking? You have to speak it up. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I said entertaining. Okay, go ahead. I added thinking. <laughs> thinking? I want to know, in the dream, how does it affect you? Interesting, exciting. Good. By the way, have you ever uh, found some things interesting before? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Also, some things exciting? Oh, if you were to rank them, where would you put that experience? Down at the bottom? On top. On top. Yeah. Oh, that's a very interesting state of mind. That's your seal. That's my what? Lucia, that's what we're talking about. Oh. You're reflecting upon it, you're enjoying it, right? It's a high state, is it not? Yeah, I mean, it feels normal. Yeah, and did you leave that for, did you then go on and get involved with other things? Um. With the Iranians and the Pakistanians and the guns and the bullets and the... No. Huh? Mm, I don't think so, no. Was it on the same level? No. Where was it? Yeah. What did you give up? I was not... You're not staying in the dream work. I was not, like, controlling it. More, come on. Like, I try to make decisions, mm -hmm. but... I'm not able to, so I'm not, like, working on the worksheet. Yeah. Did your brother enjoy it, too? I don't know. Huh? I don't know. You were totally involved in it. Yeah. 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 He's, like, yeah. not really. Yeah, on a high level. Yeah. And from then on, it goes down to here. Yeah. I, it doesn't what feel... What do you make of that? <laughs> I don't know. You left that. Yeah. Hmm. 
You like being in that state? Uh, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of look forward to getting in, into it? Definitely. Yeah. And you left it. Hmm. Should I shed a tear? No. Okay, you can. Okay. Okay, now finish it. Okay. See what happens, you see. Finish it. Um... So, I forgot where it was. So you went out to play. Oh, yes. It's one of my cousin's son's birthday. <coughs> and we're playing outside. I'm getting dirty. I always do when I go to the farm. We're playing, sitting down. It's just a bunch of kids, and I'm the oldest. The guys are chatting, but I'm playing with two kitties in a box. We're playing, and we can communicate and understand each other. And it's like I'm playing with humans, but it's more interesting and fun. And I prefer it to human interaction in that moment. The smallest guy remembers his brother's birthday, so he sings him a birthday song, which is actually a Christmas song. He mixes them up. Mm -hmm. And it was like, it was, we wish you a Merry Christmas to which he ch changes the words so he can make it into a birthday song. Uh, what state of mind was that in? <clears throat> that you were in during this? During the song or? Enjoyed it? No, du during the song or? Yes, you made up the words for the song? Yeah, it was funny. But how, well, what state of mind was that? It, Is it similar? No, uh, it's a little lower than that. But a little bit lower? Yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah. Right? Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Go ahead. Keep going. Um, yeah, the last part was funny because he said, and if your birthday is in December, a happy yeah, new year yeah. or something like okay, that. So it was fun. Go ahead. Go mm -hmm. ahead. The sun is setting. I am back inside. We're about to have dinner, and there's a young girl who seems like she doesn't belong in the setting. She's just... She's like a couple of years younger than me. We're all gonna have dinner soon, and I'm aware I'm the only person that girl could have a conversation with. Uh, because she comes from an American setting, from school, and no one is familiar with that there but me. But I choose to ignore her, and I go outside. Right out the door. Oh, just like that, same thing. What's it like ignoring her? I'm like, eh, I don't want to. But you're the only one who can converse with her. I am, yeah. So I feel kind of bad for her. Hmm. Because I feel like if I were in her position, I would want me to talk to me. Yeah, yeah. but you didn't. I didn't. What's it like knowing that? You're going down. Yeah. Right? You're going down. Go ahead. We got two more. Okay. <clears throat> um. Oh yeah. Uh, there are two dogs. Go ahead. Right out the door, there are two dogs. Shiba Inus, if it makes any difference. Uh, sitting and guarding the door. I heard that new puppies were born, and I wanted to go check them out. So I guess that's why I left. The girl. There were Lilas, who is a black dog, uh, puppies, surrounded by a short fence, and she was there with them, <coughs> nursing them. And there were other puppies with another mom. This one was brownish orange, but they weren't contained, like they weren't surrounded by a fence, and seemed to be just fine. As they will. Okay. Same thing. Uh, State of mind. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I want to know more. Yeah, but didn't get it. Hmm? Yes, you wanted more. Yeah. No, but you didn't get it. No. But I wanted more. Well, I wanted to understand more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead. I tried to. Yeah. 
Um, as I walk towards Lila, the black dog, she sees me and comes running towards me. She forgets about her puppies and she comes shooting towards me. She hasn't seen me in a while, um, I guess. She's so happy she knocks me to the ground and jumps around me. When she's done saying hi, I walk to the puppies and notice a little bit further, there's another black dog. It seems something is wrong with her. And I try to look for her puppies and she doesn't have any. I understand she's pregnant and about to give birth. So I run to the window and knock as hard as I can, but barely make any noise. Everyone is sitting down having dinner and the window is closed, uh, the, the window is closed to the table. My mother sees me and goes, what is it? And I say, the dog is giving birth, but she doesn't hear me and goes like, what? And this time I scream, the dog is giving birth. And, and, and she's like, okay, okay, you didn't have to be that loud, but I'm glad I was. Um, my aunt comes out to help and looks at the dog and says, she, she recognizes the dog, and says, she's sick anyways. And I say, so what? Um, she's sick anyways? The dog is sick anyways. So she's like, she didn't want to help her give birth because she was sick, so she was gonna die anyway. And I say, so what? And she says, leave her alone and she'll probably go by the end of the night. She means like she'll die. And, um, and I say, but she's pregnant, you have to do something. And you, you can't leave her like that. My intentions were to help her have the puppies and then kill her because she was sick. My aunt didn't seem to understand my intentions and told me that if she was going to do something, that would be to kill her. I didn't want her to, because if she was going to kill her, she would also kill the puppies in her womb. I wanted to wait until after their birth, but this didn't seem to be an option for her. I pushed her to do something about it. I, I tried to convince her, and I, and I did convince her, and she did decide to do something. She started walking to her car. Um, her hood was up and she was holding electrical cables, like the ones you use to recharge the battery, yeah. Um, I said, isn't there another way? Because she was gonna kill the dog with the cables. But before, um, but for her, there wasn't. And so she joined the clips together and created a closed circuit connected to the dog. I got to see the horrible scene. As, as she, the dog, was being electrocuted, I got lost, uh, the dog slid away and her puppies came out of her one by one mm -hmm. while she was lying away. And um, dead, I think. I'm not sure if they were dead or not. Um, as I was watching the scene, I realized that what happened was news to my aunt's eyes. She didn't expect it, but I did. So I wasn't as surprised as she was. Um, after the shock, like the electrical shock, the dog was still alive and managed to run away. Again, my aunt didn't expect her to survive, but when, we did, but when she did, it wasn't much of a surprise to me. I was mad at her and said, you just made it worse, and I felt like it was entirely her fault because she didn't listen to me. What do you think of that episode? <laughs> Come on. Uh, it was... How was your seeing compared to your aunt? My seeing? Yes, in the dream. Do you have, do you seem to finish it? Understand it better than her? Yeah, yeah, oh. I do. 
Oh, what's that like? It kind of sucks. Right? Come yeah. On. Come on. Because I can't show her. Yes. You're singing, right? You're yeah. singing. Yeah. You enjoy singing. Not really. But it's fun. I didn't say fun. I did. <laughs> I want you to correct me. It's not fun. What is it? You're seeing her. It's... It's bad. It's, it's bad. Like, Come on. It's sad. It's sad. It's frustrating. It's frustrating. Uh. Yeah. Is that because you can't get through to your aunt? Yeah. yeah, yeah. How was your singing compared to hers? It was true. Yeah. And yeah. hers wasn't. But you couldn't communicate yeah. what you saw. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah. You've been there before? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what's it like seeing and dealing with people who don't see what you see? That's what's happening in the dream. Yeah, and that's what it's like. Yeah. 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 It's yeah, it's worse than the thing. It's that worse, was right? Yeah. This is going. Yeah. Yeah. And you left the dream. Oh, I left that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Wanna go further? Yeah. Go ahead, the last one. All right. <laughs> this is a good one, go ahead. Yeah, it is. Did you read it already? Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> we went back inside, and as we were going in, I was holding socks. Right. Yeah. What? Did you socks? Sock? Socks. Thank you. She socked the mother. Oh, no, no. There no I was holding okay. socks. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Two. One or two? Two. <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> You're holding your socks. <laughs> and they're white. Um, when, I was in, when I get inside, I notice I only have one sock, and I had two before going inside. So I look for the other, and go back outside to the dogs in the front door to look for the other sock. And um, one of them had my sock in its mouth, but it was reluctant to give it to me. So I had to insist and fight a little to get it back. Um, where am I? When I get the sock, I notice that the dog is missing one leg and the other dog who's got four legs, by the way, um, has some sort of toy is playing with in his mouth. As I go inside, I decide to give the first dog a toy made of fabric, <coughs> one that I, was, that I had been collecting. And it seemed to make the dog happy. As I'm inside, I think, I think we tell people about what happened, the whole scene and the with the dog that died. And they don't really react to it, but I'm still a little shocked. Yeah, that's, that's the end. Yeah, what's going on in that last scene? There are two scenes, of course. Mm -hmm. Right, one with the sock and yeah. one with the dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, um, well, I have these socks and I feel like I need to have them, but when I see that the dog is holding, it's like playing with it. I kind of don't want to take it, but I do. Mm. And then it looks, well, it looks sad without the sock. Right. And so I think, I can give you something else. Mm -hmm. And so I give it something that, mm -hmm. of mine. Mm -hmm. You're doing fine, come. How does it end? I think. Well, we go back. Back. Uh, we, I, I'm we, in the mid inside again. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm inside, and I think we tell people what happened, and they don't really react. But I'm still a little shocked. So, like, I know it's weird, 
we go inside and I, we tell them what happened and it's this horrible thing and they don't, they don't again yeah who's the one saying me yeah, yeah. they ain't no mm -hmm. <laughs> no so in the end you're shocked <coughs> at their lack of seeing no 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 I'm shocked of the whole scene I'm not surprised by their lack of seeing how would you describe your that your ending then come on what is it like they don't really react. Yeah. What does that do to you? You see, they're not reacting to what just went on. Yeah, they, they don't. What does it do to you in the dream? It, it doesn't do much. What? It doesn't do much. That's not No, much. it's true. It doesn't do much. <coughs> Give me another word. Okay. Um, doesn't do much. I feel like I stopped caring. Yeah, you stopped caring. Like I expected them not to. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You're expecting them to see what you see. No, I expect. I don't expect them. Yeah, yeah but yeah. It, ideally you would like them to see. I would like them, yeah. Yeah, but you're seeing that they don't. Mm -hmm. What's it do to you? Mm. It's sad. All through this, you're seeing, aren't you? But this is what you give up. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> yeah. What do you think you ought to do about that? What was the dream about in the dream? The dream about? Do you have any idea what the dream was about? That you were doing homework on? No. Your dream? Well, I was doing homework on the dream. Yeah. So was the dream about the dream? I just wondered, did you know anything that was going on in the dream? Yeah. What? Like, what was the storyline? I knew, I didn't expect it uh, to shift that much initially. Because right. it, it changed. I knew, come on. I knew as I was going through it, I knew what was coming right next. Ah. How's your seeing? My seeing? Yeah. Pretty good. You're able to see what's coming next? Not really. <laughs> well, now it's not really? Well, it's not really good because I know that what's coming next, it's not, it's not good. It's like, it sucks. Oh, no. I'm not dealing with that. I'm dealing with the dream. It's cool that I can see what's coming next. I don't know how cold. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's. I like it. I like a little bit. Yeah. A lot of bit. A lot. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. Why are you having this dream? Telling you that you're doing good, doing one thing, and feeling disillusioned with other people, aren't you? How's your seeing? Good? Yeah. Other people are having? Bad seeing. Yeah. They need yeah. glasses. What are you going to do living in a world where you're doing the seeing and they're not? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> it's yours. Thank you. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. <laughs> so I'll pick up the times next time. Oh, okay. Can I ask if anybody has my car keys? I cannot find them. I think I left them on the table. And I think I left them.